one of my Kids Pet Day. Yay! This is my pet. Where is all the Spider Fit Kids? Hey, Spider Fit Kids. It's Coach Brett here. Where are you at today is pet day. I got my pet, the magic dog Gizmo. And she was being a little screen shy earlier, but bring out, bring out either your stuffed or your real pet because tomorrow is gonna be parents day. And I'm gonna talk more about that. But tomorrow we're gonna be inviting mom and dad to join you for PE in your living room. We're gonna be doing all kinds of fun stuff. Good morning, Tanner in Brooklyn. But let's see your pet. Good morning, Emma. I got my pet. I got my animal here, Gizmo the Magic Dog. There's Emma. Do we got Sophie and Ella here? We got, do we got Owen? Oh, I see Owen there. I see Kaylani here. I see Sophie. Like I said, it's animal day. So if you've got a stuffed animal, if you got a real animal, go ahead and bring them out because my animal right here, Gizmo the Magic Dog, is gonna be helping us today. Oh, Zach, oh, dog Izzy is here. Zach and Max are here with Izzy. Oh, and they and Owen and Henry have a cat named Kitty and a dog named Puppy. I like those names. I like those names. Now, well, before we get started, just like yesterday, I need you to get a couple things. First thing, make sure you got two pillows. Ask mom and dad if you can have two pillows. And the cool part is we're also going to, just like yesterday, have your favorite book. Now see, Spider-Fi Kid Maddie's favorite book is There's a Locket in My Pocket. Has anyone ever seen that? Well, and I like this book, Where the Sidewalk Ends by Shel Silverstein. So get your favorite book and we're gonna get two pillows. And then also, we got our pillows. I want you to go ahead and take your shoes off so it's just your socks. All right, are we ready to get started? We got our pillows, we got our books, we got everything. Well, the first thing I wanna do is, oh, it looks like Silas's cat Gandalf is here too. Well, I wanna start today. Oh, and it looks like, uh, now, uh, now this is a, a recent pet. This is one of our animals. And what's her name? Tawny and she's a pet caterpillar. It's Tawny the pet caterpillar. Yes, we found Tawny the pet caterpillar in our yard. So that's another animal. Good morning, Trey and Callie. Now I had some mom and dads let me know what their kids were thankful for. So that's what we're working on this week. What are you thankful for? So if you're thankful for something, if your child is thankful for something, have that conversation and let us know. So I'm just gonna read off some of these. Lucy is thankful for her mom and dad. Piper is thankful her mom got married. Jax is thank you for all the good food. Kaylani is thankful for spider fit. Well, thank you, Kaylani. Ella is thankful for her slack line. Sophianne is thankful for everything. Tessie is thankful for her family. Russell is thankful for every living thing. Ayla is thankful for spider fit kids. Well, we're thankful for you too, Ayla. Lucy is thankful for family and food. Zach and Max are thankful for their family. Alta is thankful for her family. Good morning, Brandon. Laura and Laura is thankful for her family and so is Beck. So mom and dad, go ahead and post up so I can read what, what your kids are thankful for. So tell mom and dad what you're thankful for. And while everyone's listening, tomorrow is Parents' Day. Tomorrow's Parents' Day. So mom and dad, I want you to jump in and have some fun with your kids. All right, so... Yes, there's some people who don't have this. They're thankful for all we have. So let's get up and let's start moving. Let's start swimming those arms. We're going to start by swimming today. Swim those arms. It might be warm. It might be cold where you're at. We're thinking about when can we get back to the pool. So let's go and start swimming those arms. Let's go and help me out here, spider Fit Kid Maddie. Let's go and put Gizmo down. And let's swim those arms forward. And now let's swim those arms backward. Really reach up. Really reach up. Now can we swim like this? Swim through your living room. Swim through your living room. Here we go. We're swimming through your living room. Swimming through your living room. Good job, swimming. Now what I want you to do is we're gonna get in the edge of the pool and I want you to jump into the pool. Ready, and go. Jump into the pool. Okay, that was easy, that was easy. Now I wanna see you do a trick. Good morning, Brinley and Boyd. We're gonna do a trick into the pool. So I want you to do a trick jumping into the pool. So my trick is- Cannonball! Gonna... <laughs> so I have a kid, Maddie, cannonball. I'm gonna do a spin. Ready, jump into the pool and spin. All right, good. Now let's see, what's your trick jumping into the pool? Let's see it. Cannonball! 
All right, good. Now, everyone, stand up. Now, what we're going to do is I want you to start marching, but I want you to march like we're in deep snow. March like you're in deep snow. Oh, I'm marching. Get those legs up like you're in deep snow. Good. That's it. Ooh, ooh Brandon and Colin want to get back to the swim team. Now, march in deep snow. That snow is up to here. It's cold. It's snowing. March like you're marching in deep snow. Now, come down to the ground. And we're gonna crawl like we're on a hot frying pan. We're gonna crawl like we're in a hot frying pan. Ooh, ooh. Crawl like you're on a hot frying pan. What would that look like? Ooh, pick those toes, that's it. That's it, good job. All right, frying pan's off. Now, I want you to pretend like you've got a big river in front of you and there's rocks across the river. So we have to hop from rock to rock to get across the river. So it's gonna look like, there you go, good. That's it, so I'm gonna hop to one rock, bounce, hop to the other rock, get across the river, good. Hop to the, that's it, now I'm gonna hop back. So it's going to hop back across the river. Hop, 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 and hop. Good job, now we're gonna start running, and let's start running around your living room. Run around your living room, but I want you to imagine like you're running in Jello. What flavor of Jello should we use? You're running in cherry jello. What would that look like if you're running in jello? I would have to go through, I'd have to run through, I'm, I'm, I'm eating it as I go, because I like cherry jello. Run through jello. I'm running through jello. That's it. That's it. I'm running through jello. We're all running through jello. Can you run faster through jello? Run faster through jello and stop. Okay, the first thing we're gonna do is remember we worked on how to squat. So when we squat, we're gonna take our hips and our hips are gonna move down towards the ground. Okay, so we're gonna start here just like this. We're gonna squat down. Now, let's just start, let's do three squats. So spider if we keep back, let's put that down and we're gonna help everybody do squats. Here we go. So we're gonna squat down and come up. That's one, let's just do two. That's it, and two. Now I want you to, when I say go, you're gonna squat. When I say stop, you're gonna stop. Ready, go. So we're gonna squat, that's it, squat and stop. And go, and stop, and go, and stop, and go. Good job, now everybody on one leg. Whoa, balance on one leg. Oh, we're balancing on one leg. Okay, now I want you to squat down on one leg and come up. Squat down on one leg, whoa, oh, that's balance. Good job, squat down and up. Let's go to the other leg now. Find your balance, find your balance, and let's just do three of them, and that's one, that's it, two, and three. Good job. Now, who likes to play baseball or softball? Axel, do you like to play baseball or softball? How about Adeline, do you like to play baseball or softball? Okay, now here's what we're gonna do. You're gonna spin just like this. I'm gonna turn my arms, let's see everybody do that. Like I'm throwing, there you go, like I'm swinging a golf club, just like that. Now I want you to do it fast. Let's do it fast. Now make your arms as long as you can. Make your arms as long as you can. Good, now make your arms super short by giving yourself a hug and still rotate, and still rotate, good job. Now let's do it to the other side, switch sides. Make sure we go to that other side. So here we go. We're gonna chop and up, chop and up. Big arms, make your arms big and let's go fast. Let's go fast, good, now give yourself a hug and let's go, there you go, good. Give yourself a hug and rotate, good job. Now everybody balance on a foot. Balance on one foot, oh, who can balance? Don't let that other toe touch. Don't let it touch the lava. Now, on that one foot, I want you to start hopping as fast as you can. Start hopping as fast as you can, good. That's it, now hop slow. And hop, and hop. Now hop side to side. Who can hop side to side? It's like a dance. Side to side, good, hop side to side, good job. Now let's go to the other foot. Can you hop fast? Who can hop faster? I'm going one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Now can you go slow? One, two, three, four, and five. Now can you go side to side? Can you hop side to side? Let's see, good job. Hop side to side, very good. Now I want you to start running around your living room. Run around your living room, but I want you to make your legs and your arms super wide. We're, gonna, we're, gonna, we're running, but I look like a monster. Run, <laughs> that feels funny, whoa. 
Now, make your arms and legs super narrow. Can you make them super narrow and run? That feels funny too. Can you make it super narrow and run? I'm running. Oh, that's it. Can you make it super narrow and run? Okay, now we're going to run in place. Who can run the fastest in place? That's it. Good job. Now, let's go ahead and grab those pillows. So if you're just joining us, we need two pillows. We need two pillows if you just got it, okay? So, I'm gonna grab my two pillows, just like this, and let's put the pillows on the floor. In order to do this, let's go ahead and take our shoes off. Notice I'm in my socks. And we're gonna put your pillows on the floor. And we're gonna start, I just want you to stand on your pillows, just like this. And I want you to reach out. I want you to think like you're surrounded by lava, but I see a leaf floating by. So reach out and grab that leaf and then stand back up. How far can you reach? Let's do another reach. How far can you reach out without falling down? Good. How far can you reach behind you without falling down? So we're standing on those pillows. Can you reach behind you without falling down? Really reach. And let's reach to the, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Reach to the other side. We're surrounded by lava. Don't fall off your lava boat. I'm going to reach back. Reach back. Good. Reach back. And stand up. Good. Now, on our lava boat, we have to go to one foot. We have to go to one foot. And I want to see you. Can you look like a tree? Can you look like a tree on that one foot? Can you make yourself look like a tree? And balancing. Good. Now, can you reach down? And let's test that lava. On one foot. Let's go down. Let's test that lava. Oh, it's definitely hot. It's definitely hot. Let's go to the other leg. Just like this. We're balancing. Good job. Now, I want to see, can you be a tree? So can you be standing up? Can you put your hands up above your head? Stand tall. Oh, I'm wobbling. I'm wobbling. All right, good. Hold it now. I want you to go down. Let's test the lava. Come on down. Let's test that lava. Oh, it's hot. That lava's hot. Let's test it one more time. Keep that balance on one foot. Come down. Test it. And come on, oh, good job. All right, I turned off the lava button. The floor around you is no longer lava because we got a game. Lucy in Portland, are you ready for a game? All right, let's see what you got. I'm gonna move these to the side, just like this. And we're gonna do jumping jacks. So let's see everybody do jumping jacks. So I can do jumping jacks. Last week I was tricking you with jumping jacks and I'm gonna trick you again this week. So we're gonna reach up just like that. Okay, so. We're gonna turn into race cars. I'm no, I'm no longer Coach Brett, I'm a race car. And here's how the race car is gonna go. When I say one, that's first gear, that's slow. So what would jumping jacks look like in first gear? They'd look like this. Slow, 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 slow. And then I'm gonna say second gear, a little bit faster. A little bit faster. Third gear, a little bit faster. And then fourth gear is as fast as you can go. Okay, let's get those jumping jacks. Let's go race cars. Who's ready to race car? We're gonna start in first gear. Ready and go. First gear. Second gear. Second gear is a little bit faster. Third gear. Fourth gear. Fourth gear. Fourth gear. That's it. Arms go fast. That's, that's it. First gear. Second gear. Third gear. Fourth gear, that's it, that's it, that's it. Second gear, oh, which one's second gear? I almost forgot. Third gear, that's it. First gear, third gear, fourth gear, second gear, first gear, fourth gear, fourth gear, third gear, Ooh, second gear, Ooh, third gear, Ooh, first gear. Ooh, Ooh. All right, race cars, nice job. Now, remember I said, this week, we're gonna learn how to jump. And I don't mean just a little hop. I mean, I want you to be able to jump out of your roof. So yesterday we worked, remember, let's try that again, what we did yesterday. Remember when I said one, where did our hands go when I said one? Um, above our head. So put your hands above your head. Two was, yes, yeah. two, we're gonna put our hands down like that. So let's gonna try one, hands up above your head. Two, bend your knees, and they go below my waist. And then when I see three, we're gonna throw those arms up and we're gonna jump out of the roof. Here we go, ready? One, two, one. Ha, 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 I tricked you. One, two, three. Good job, let's try it again. One, two, three, as high as you can. One more time. One, reach.
reach up there. Two, arms go down. Three, jump as high as you can. Good job. Now this time, we're not just gonna jump, but I want you to land like we have shocks on your legs. So we're gonna land with, with shocks on our legs, so our legs are gonna bend, just like that. So I land, my knees are gonna bend. Let's just try that. Jump and land and your knees bend. Jump and land, bend your knees, good. Jump and land, bend your knees. One more time, jump, bend your knees, good job. So you think we can put all that together? You think we can do one, two, three, and then land on the ground with our knees bent? Like we're landing on top of an eggshell? Because that floor that was just lava, it's an eggshell now. And we gotta land on top of the eggshell without breaking the egg. Are you ready? Let's give it a try. So when we land, I want you to land so soft and so quiet and bend those knees, ready? One, two, three, land on the eggshell. Let's try again. One, two, three, land on the eggshell. Good, let's see that. Let's see you drop your hips and bend your knees. Ready? One, two, three. All right, now this time I'm gonna listen. I'm gonna listen. I wanna see if I hear any feet when you land. So when you land, I want you to bend your knees and make it as quiet as you can. Let's go, ready? One, hands up above your head. Two, hands come down below your waist. Three, jump. Ooh, that was so quiet. Let's try it one more time where it's so quiet, it actually puts me to sleep. And I got a lot of energy, you know that. Let's see if it can be so quiet that it puts me to sleep. Okay, I'm gonna listen. Ready, one, hands go up, two, one, ha <laughs> I checked you, two. All right, when I say three, when you land, I'm gonna listen, two, hands are down, hands are down, and three, jump. Oh, that was so quiet. I'm so proud of you, good job, very good. Now we're gonna play a little game I call bear, crab, and butterfly. Watch how we play it. Yeah, so a bear, what does a bear look like? Let's see what a bear looks like. Let's see, Ayla, hey, can you show me what about, okay, good. That's a, uh, Lucy, what does a bear look like? Does a bear have their knees on the ground? Okay, very good, very good. All right, good, let's see what a bear, so a bear looks like this. A bear looks like this. Knees are off the ground, my knees don't touch the ground, so knees off the ground, just like this. And then a crab, what would a crab look like? A crab looks like this with their hips up, and then a butterfly looks like this with the wings open on your side. Or we could do okay, this. Okay, so let's give it a try. Or we could do this. Yes. Okay, so let's be a bear. Let's see everybody be a bear. Now a crab. Whew. Now a butterfly. Woo! that butterfly is tough. And bear. Crab. Bear. Butterfly. Woo-hoo-hoo. Crab, Whew. butterfly, let's see your butterfly, bear, Whew. butterfly, crab, ah. bear, crab, ah. bear, oh, no. and crab, and butterfly, oh, two more, ready, crab, and bear, and butterfly, oh, that was very tough. We're making those stomach muscles so strong. Now, let's go and get that favorite book. You just had your favorite book. Let's go and grab your favorite book because it's almost time for the 60 second plank party again. So, get got our favorite book and I want you to put your favorite book down on the ground. So, let's put your favorite book down on the ground. Now, I want you to balance on one leg. We're balancing on one leg. And I want you to go down, I want you to flip to your favorite page in your favorite book without putting this foot on the ground. So I'm balancing, let's see if you can come down, flip to your favorite page. Ooh, I like that page. I like that page. There you go, and then come back up, and let's go to the other foot. Let's go to the other foot, so stand up, stand up, and let's go down just like this, and let's look at the pages. Ooh, that's a good page. And come back up. So we got our balance. Now what I want you to do is I want you to start, and I want you to step up over your book. So it's going to look like this. Big step over. Big step over your book. Let's see a big step over. One side, then the other side. 
Well, let's pretend like your book is a little river and we're stepping over your river. Good, step over that book. Can you go faster? Uh, faster, that's it. Faster, faster. I wanna see who can go the fastest. Let's see it, Max. Let's see it, Zach, who can go fast? Let's see it, that's it. Go good, Jackson. Good, Benny, even faster, and stop. Now we're gonna jump over your book. We're gonna jump. So our feet together, I want you to jump and use your arms. So think one, two, three, and soft. One, two, three, let's jump over your book and go. Jump, let's do 10 of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, both feet, seven, good, eight, nine, and 10, good job. Now, with your feet and going as fast as they can, I wanna see if you can make a circle around your book. So the book's on the ground, can you make a circle around your book with fast feet? Let's do five of them. Ready, and go one, two, good job, even faster, Whew, three, that's it, feet, four and five. Good job. Now, make sure you're looking at me the whole time because we're going to go the other way. Ready? And go. One. And that's it. Two. Good job. Three. Fast feet. Four. And five. Very good. Those feet were moving so fast. You know what I like to do after you do a good job? is I like to host a party. And this week, it's the 60 second plank party. Mom and dad, let me know which kids are in the 60 second plank party. I'll read my book. Here we go, and grab your book so you have something to read while we have our party. And if you want, you can use your pillow to put your arms down. So let's go put your arms down. I'm gonna get my timer, my official timer here. All right, everybody, come on down. No. So we're gonna come on down, and I want you on your elbows, and we're gonna, don't let your knees come down for 60 seconds. All right, are we ready? And I'm gonna read a little story here out of the book. Okay, here we go, on your elbows, who's in that 60 plank, second plank party, and bring those knees up, good job. So Agatha Fry, she made a pie, and Christopher John helped bake it. Christopher John, he mowed the lawn, and Agatha Fry helped rake it. But Zachary Zug took out the rug, and Jennifer Joy helped shake it. And Jennifer Joy, she made a toy, and Zachary Zug helped break it. And some kind of help is the kind of help it's, it's helping all about. And some kind of help is the kind of help we can't all do without. So sometimes when we help, it's good, but sometimes when we help, it can be bad, but let's always look for ways to help. Can you go 15 more seconds? Don't put those knees down. I wanna see who's in the club today. I wanna see who's in the club. That's it, keeping those legs up, keeping those hips up. In three, two, and come on up. Good job, mom and dad, let me know who is in that 60 second plank party because we are gonna have that plank party at the end of the week. So here's our last game. What I want you to do is you're gonna close your eyes. So everybody close their eyes. Close your eyes. Now we're gonna use our listening superpower. I want you to listen and I'm gonna to count to 10 very softly. I want you to listen for three things that you might never have heard before. Okay, so when you close your eyes, you're gonna listen for three things you might have never heard before. Here we go, close your eyes. Good morning, Ayla. Good, eyes are closed, listen. Five. And open your eyes. Now tell mom and dad or whoever's in the room with you, what are three things, three new things that you've never heard before that you heard? Because sometimes during the daytime, let's try to do that a couple times today. If you're starting to, you're running around playing or doing things like that, play the game, stop, close your eyes and see who can hear the quietest sound. Now, I'm excited today because I get to read off 
all the kids in the playing party. Now, if you made the playing party today, mom and dad, let me know, and I'll add you to the list. So let's go ahead and check it out. Who made the plank party? All right, this is who can do the 60 second plank without putting their knees down. We got Callie from New York, Adeline from Canada, Kaylani from California, Sophie Ann from Canada. Canada, good job. Ayla from Oregon, Sasha from New York, Colin from Maryland, Owen from Utah, Madison from California, Russell from Canada, Jackson from Florida, Benny from Florida, Lucy J from Oregon, Lena, Beck, and Tanner from Oregon, and Brooklyn from Oregon. All right, so mom and dad, I wanna get them on the list. Let me know if they're in for the 60 second plank party. If I didn't get you today, I'll make sure to put it down tomorrow. This week is gonna be quite the party because we're gonna work on getting those tummy muscles so strong that we don't put those knees down when we do our planks. Now, remember, tomorrow is a very special day. Now, I have to admit, I thought today was tomorrow. Yesterday, I was, my brain was going all so many places, so now my brain is good again. So, tomorrow, mom and dad. Invite mom and dad to come to PE in your living room. Mom and dad are gonna do the exercises with you. It's gonna be so much fun. Mom and dad, don't worry. It's just gonna be a lot of fun. It's not gonna be super, super hard. It's just gonna be a lot of fun. So invite mom and dad to come with you tomorrow. Same time, same place. Now, if mom and dad, you wanna learn more about what we're doing here and what the method behind the madness is, make sure to go to spiderfitfree.com and please, Tell your friends. We want to reach people all over the world and reach kids and let them know that right now it's fun to move. They feel better when they move. All right, so, and also mom and dad, let us know what the kids are thankful for. Have those discussions posted here. I want to read it off tomorrow. So go out, be safe, have a great day. Remember, movement feels good. So get out and move whenever you can. Bye-bye.